Hey, what's up? I'm Colleen and welcome to my channel. I'm just a girl who's enthusiastic about makeup and positivity. And when I say positivity, I mean bringing people up, not pushing people down. Being mean is not cool. Awesome people are not mean, so be kind all the time. So I'm sorry about the loud noise in the background. Um, in New York, it's starting to get hot, so I'm going to need my air conditioner on. It's probably going to be on for most of my videos in the next few months just because I can't not have it on in here. I shoot in my bedroom and my bedroom is either like an oven or it's ice cold. So there's like no in between. And if I don't have my air conditioner on, I can't even like, it's just, I'm really uncomfortable. You know, I'm spoiled. I get to put my AC on and I'm not uncomfortable anymore. Um, yeah, so I do apologize in advance. I hope it won't bother you too much. I'm not like fancy, like I don't have a mic or anything. So I can't like set that up and then like take the noise in the background out. Like I'm just, I'm not equipped for that yet. <laughs> so anyway, before I get into the video, I just wanted to say one thing very quickly from on my channel and um, I stand for equality for all. I don't understand why people treat each other with such disrespect just because they may not look like you or they may not love like you or they may not practice the same religion as you. What makes this world so great is that we are all different and we are all unique and that's what makes the world go round. So just remember, like I say, be kind to people, treat people with respect because how you have to remember like what you put out comes back to you. So anyway, that is all I wanted to say on that. So for this video, we are back doing glamour in pajamas. I haven't done it in a few weeks. I don't know why, it just hasn't like been able to fit into my schedule. So I'm really excited. I do glamour in pajamas because there is not a time when it is not appropriate to be glamorous. So why not be glamorous in your pajamas? Like totally. And plus like when I'm in my pajamas, sometimes I get like ideas. I want to try, try out like different makeup looks and stuff. So I thought like, why not just do it on camera? I feel like I'm talking really fast and I'm rambling on. So I apologize for that. So for this edition of Glamour in Pajamas, I am actually going to use the Violet Boss Sugar Crystals palette. I've had this for a little while and I keep forgetting to use it on my channel. I really, really like it because A, it like looks really pretty on the, <laughs> the packaging and B, um, look at these colors. They're so nice. Um, they're kind of like neon-y, pastel -y, and they're just like really pretty. And this whole like thing just speaks to me. And I heard like decent reviews on it. So a while ago, I finally bit the bullet and bought it. I haven't played with it like a lot, a lot, but I have used it. And for the most part, I'm happy with how it performs. I don't have any complaints about it. Um, it's not like, you know, like the most exceptional like palette, like blows all the other palettes out of the water, but it performs decently. It, it performs good. And you know, it was worth the money. I, I know I got it on sale. I did not pay full price for this. So, and I got it on Sephora's website. So I am really, really excited to finally do a look on the channel with this palette. I'm going to use the green row right here because it kind of goes with my pajama shirt, which I know you guys can't see it. Oh yeah, my shirt says here to pet all the cats. You can't see it, but I get this cat lady box. <laughs> so, oh my God, I'm never finding a husband. Um, this cat lady box once a month and I get like stuff for myself and then two, treat, two treats, two toys for my, my baby girl, Layla. And I've gotten so many t-shirts that are cat themed and I like love it so much because I am such an animal lover. Like, oh my God. And my baby girl is like, she's so cute. I'll post a picture of her right here. This picture I'm posting is my favorite picture of all time that I've ever taken of her because she looks like she wants to kill me. She was not happy about that at all. She does love me though. Like she lets me cuddle her and stuff, but she's a cat. So cats, you know, um, do things on their own terms, but that's what's so cool about them is that they're they're independent little things. So anyway, I'm going to stop rambling because I'm almost five minutes into the video and we're gonna get into creating a fun glamour and pajamas sugar crystals look. So to start off, I prime my eyes with the e.l.f. Putty Primer. It's okay, it's definitely not like a favorite favorite of mine, but it definitely works for the price and I don't hate that I bought it. I'm you know glad I finally tried it, but I still prefer the P. Louise base. That's still my favorite, so. But I mean, it's actually not bad. I don't know why I like kind of sounded negative when I first said that I definitely don't hate it I also want to point out I finally tried the AOA Pro Wear Studio full coverage foundation which I'm wearing right now this was a dollar 55 I believe and it worked really 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 well like I think it looks really nice on my skin and it matches pretty good it's a little light but I was able to kind of darken it up a little bit with um 
my blush and bronzer and stuff so it doesn't make me look like sick or anything. I mean, I'm pale anyway. I haven't gotten a tan yet and I really don't tan all that great. I like get burnt and then I just kind of stay, it kind of fades and, <laughs> and then I kind of just am still really pale. But you know, it's my Irish, my Irish blood. I'm half Italian too, but I didn't get that great, uh, lovely olive complexion from my dad. I got my mom's Irish English very pale complexion. <laughs> so anyway, let's get into actually creating a look. I'm very, I apologize, I already feel like my eyes tearing. I'm very rambly today, I'm not sure why. So to start off, I'm going to go in to this, it's called Mint Choco right here. And I'm going to use a Moda BMX 466 shader brush. And I'm just going to apply that actually all over my lid. This is actually going to be a pretty minimal, like, um, color eye look. And I'm not even, I'm not going to use a lot of shadows either. and just kind of smooth it out a little bit. So now for my brow bone, I'm actually going to go next to the green row and I'm gonna go into the yellow row. I'm gonna go into this color butter buttercream on the bottom. I wasn't sure if it said buttermilk or buttercream. I thought it was buttercream, but then I'm like, wait a minute. And I'm gonna put that in my brow bone. It's a really pretty color. This palette is so summery to me. Like, I just, I love it. Really quickly before I go on and finish my eyes, um, I got the Elf and Jay Kissa uh, palette, the one that you know benefits the animals and stuff. And I used it. I played around with it. I'm gonna do a video on it soon. I've been playing with it, um, and I think it works pretty good. I'm not. I won't. You know, I'm gonna do a review on it. So, but it stains your brushes. Look at this brush. This is my E25 from Sigma. I wash this with my very trusty charcoal brush cleanser that can clean anything like it's the most amazing brush cleaner and it's from Walmart it's this one right here Ooh. it stained it it won't come out and also on my my bottom brush it stained the blue stained it and I washed them last night and just, I mean scrubbed them like you know is gently but aggressively um, and it stained them so I'm hoping I eventually can get it out but I'm like what the hell but anyway that's all I want to say okay so now I'm just going to apply with my finger over the um, mint chocolate color. I'm going to go into this color pistachio right here and I'm just going to use my finger because it's like a satin metallic and I'm just going to apply it all over. I'm not using any glitter glue or anything. This actually performs pretty decently without all that and because like I'm just putting it all over I don't mind if it travels a little bit. I'm just going to repeat that on the other eye. Didn't really pick any of them in there. So like that. And then I want to take the brush that I had mint choco on and very lightly just go over the tops where pistachio and that color meet just to kind of blend them out. I mean, not that it really needs any blending because they're pretty much very similar. So it's going to look like this so far. So off camera, I just finished up this eye and then I went in on this eye with the LA Girl uh, Shockwave Neon Eyeliner in the color Fresh on my waterline. 
And now I am just going to dip back into that color mint choco, which is the matte green that I use. And I'm going to apply that to my lower lash line. Below my lower lash line, excuse me. And then I'm gonna take my little blending brush and blend it out. And then for my inner corner, I'm going to go in to, I can grab my brush, the color Limeade on the bottom right here. And I'm gonna pop that in the inner corner. It's a good inner, inner corner color, just like that. This is my final look right here. I like it. It's fun. It's pastel-y. It's springy. It's cute. I love the way I like the way this palette works. I love kind of doing mono any look that I've done with this. Um, I've actually done this kind of look, just like a monochromatic kind of look, just because I think it's fun to do that with this palette. I think it works great that way. And these colors are so pastel-y and pretty. They're nice to be showcased, like you know, on their own rather than mixing them with a whole bunch of other colors. And then um, just to finish up, I put uh, Best of Me's lipstick in the color make it blue make it pink it's one of those ones that's pink and it i mean blue and it changes to pink because it's from the sleeping beauty um collection which i absolutely love so anyway that is it for this uh video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please feel free to give it a, a like if you really 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 liked it please feel free to subscribe if you want to do neither one of those things that is totally fine thank you for stopping by and spending this one minute with me i really really appreciate it thank you so so much as always i will list everything that i'm wearing on my face as well as my twitter and instagram handles in case you want to follow me there i post pictures of looks that i do not film as well as pictures of my pets and i think they are adorable but we are all biased when it comes to our fur babies so oh well and also no you're not crazy i did go back to being a blonde in case you didn't notice so anyway from one makeup lover to another i hope you guys have a fantastic day and remember be you do you love you bye